This is NBC Nightly News with Brian Williams. You hear that voice at the top of this broadcast every night. It is, of course, the voice of our friend, the great Michael Douglas, actor, producer, Academy Award winner. Well, last night he shocked David Letterman's audience and by extension all of us with his revelation that he is battling stage four throat cancer, a serious illness, and he speculated about what might have brought it on. We knew he was sick. None of us knew how sick. Our chief science correspondent, Robert Bazell, has more on the fight he has ahead of him. September 24th. Ladies and gentlemen, please say hello to Michael Douglas. Michael. Michael Douglas strode onto David Letterman's stage last night to promote his new film, but instead made a shocking announcement. I've got cancer, found out about it uh, three, uh, three weeks uh, ago. I've um, got a uh, biopsy, they analyzed it. It's a stage four, which is intense. Douglas, who is 65, has had a stellar career on television and in the movies. You're going to have to kill me. Winning an Oscar for his portrayal of Gordon Gekko in the 1987 film Wall Street. Greed, for lack of a better word, is good. I'm sorry to be dumb about this, but you, you look great and you don't sound like you have throat cancer. Now, is, why is that? Because I'm on stage. <laughs> because Kirk, he said, son, you got to look good. You never know where you might have cancer. <laughs> and Douglas was very clear about the likely cause of his tumor, a combination that is responsible for a large portion of the more than 30,000 cases of head and neck cancers every year. I smoked cigarettes and I drank. Dr. Edward Kim of MD Anderson Cancer Center treats this sort of cancer and says that a diagnosis of stage four can sound far worse than the actual prognosis. In fact, many patients with stage four in head and neck cancer, which means they have spread to the local lymph nodes, can be cured with our therapies, including chemotherapy and radiation. People magazine reports Douglas had a sore throat and other symptoms for months, but doctors found the tumor only three weeks ago. And now he's in treatment and hopeful. Uh, percentages are, are, are very good, I would hate to say, but right now it looks it should be like 80%. Douglas will continue his radiation and chemotherapy for months. Uh, well, and many well, clearly I, I wish him well in this new and you? most difficult ah, role. Give me a hug. All right, <laughs> my God. Robert Bazell, NBC News, New York. We do too. We'll take a break. When we come back, what we learned today about the workplace.